Good. I know the alarm was like, I mean, I didn't have to wake up to hear it. I was already awake. We're on a budget. We got one field tip. <laughs> <laughs> Probably 10 years ago, Martin and I started um, enjoying the outdoors a little bit more so and, you know, going fishing and then getting a chance to go hunting. And he had more opportunities to go hunting before um, I did. It's been a whole lot of fun to just experience it with somebody who has common interests and spend four days and then go back to the, uh, the business chair of the, of the race car and do what we do there pretty strong wind that's in the right direction to get in there on them, so we'll see what we can do. It's a great escape for me. I love to hunt. I have since I was a kid, but to come out here and do it this way is just something totally different. Boy, way out there. I feel like every time I go on a trip like this and, and go back to the racetrack, I'm better because I'm just relaxed and fired up again and good way to recharge the batteries and, and be thankful for the things that we do have. set up here, listening, see if we hear any bugles, and try to figure out a direction to head, but it should be another good day. To me, there's nothing better than getting the opportunity to chase an elk with a bow. Just the opportunity to be part of the wild. You know, talk about the story of where that bull came from or where that buck came from and things like that. I think it's grounding for all of us. Some of us just don't realize it. These cows are coming right here. They're coming right by us. together with a lot of cows and you know a lot of eyes and ears and noses to try to fool so tough to get in close. Let's go. I'm not 
sure which way he went. That's too far for me, man. We're lucky we got away with this one. There they go. <laughs> you can't, you just gotta laugh. It's tough to come that close, but at the same time, it's just so cool to be in the middle of those elk and hear them, just how vocal they're being and see how they interact. And you know, some of those ones you don't close the deal on are some of the, the coolest encounters and, and the coolest stalks that you can get into. At the racetrack, we still have to stay focused on, you know, being as fast as we can. Um, away from the racetrack, you know, we're, we're hunters, we're fishermen, we, we love the outdoors. If you, uh, if you don't like the outdoors, then there's something wrong with you.